Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Topics with me, where today we're going to be doing something just a little bit different. Now, before we get started, I got a comment from one of my more recent videos from someone that was asking, why do you say it's going to be different? Why do you say it's going to be unique? Why do you say... Because I can. I'm just saying. Uh, so, within that context, I'm using that line as like a... Come in, you know, this is a fun channel. This is what we do. <laughs> to the newer people that don't know my channel that well. So I kind of use it in as a greeting, a overused greeting, but a greeting nonetheless. And I use it kind of like to en emphasize what we're doing. It's Every video that I've made is different. And it's original, which is why it's called DK Originals. But I'm going to be talking about that a little bit after the intro starts. But anyway, roll it. My name is Derek Amal, and I am proud to be I'm in another town with my family And so I found a place where everyone will be Let's talk discreetly, this is Topics with me So going off of the topic that uh, I kind of went over before the intro started I wanted to kind of go back to that and say that I have a unique style to the channel at this point. I've been doing this for almost two years and I kind of just have kind of like a a knowing for the channel. In that context, I mean that at this point, I know that I do specific things for each series in each of the channels and I have different ways of expressing it throughout uh, all of the series that I've ever made and will make in the future because, hint, I'm probably not gonna stop here. So, I'm going to move that out of the way and talk about the real topic. What I was thinking I would be talking about today, and I've been wanting to do this for a long time, but I've just, I've never had the experience. I never thought that I would have all of the knowledge that I do now. And I've just by kind of been holding it off for any future Topics With Me episode. And I feel like I'm actually ready and have the time to talk to you guys about this specific topic. I just wanted to talk about YouTube in general, because now more than ever in history, YouTube and pretty much an online site has been taking over the industry completely. I've been thinking about this for the past few weeks. Uh, there's this new double ad policy that YouTube is attending and it's kind of supposed to stop ad blockers from doing such things and kind of get more content creators more money because there's two sponsors. And then the fact that people are hearing things off of YouTube instead of cable at this point it's kind of taking me by surprise. Now, it can hurt people's reputations like Disney and NBC, who pretty much own everything on TV and in movies. But I think that they're moving on to streaming services as well. I heard that NBC is doing their own separate streaming service and taking everything off of Netflix and kind of transforming that into their own streaming service with their own original TV shows that have either aired in the past or not. I heard that because people were watching The Office and it's going to get shut down and stuff like that. And then Disney starting their own, you know, production company that's kind of held around the fact that you can stream online and you could pay like $10 a month to kind of view their content, their movies that they've made. You will have first access to it from the theaters. It'll just, and they own everything. They own 20th Century Fox. They own CBS. They own um, if you can't believe it, they own parts of NBC and it's just, I don't know, uh, people are just moving on and I guess there's room for us, the future generation of YouTubers, the people that start now and make good content for the next um, century or decade. So I urge you guys to start, you know, start making content if you guys are interested. You guys could become big. Uh, it could be a good permanent job, especially it's it's better to start earlier. So I started, I started my channel before I left middle school, but I started it, like started doing it in high school in my first year. And now it's the end of my second year and I'm going into my third year. And I just, I can't believe that you guys have done this, you know, just subscribed, commented, just done this is just a general word for everything that you've ever done to support me and my channel endeavors, okay? Vandavas. And the fact that I can actually just sit down here and talk with you guys. I mean, I had a special, I had a special announcement. I, I didn't really do anything special for the 3000th episode and I'm planning it. Don't worry, I'm, I'm definitely planning it. 
uh, before I get to my next milestone, which is probably 300, uh, sorry, 3,500. And I just, I want you guys to know that I am planning something. I just, I've done so many specials that I, I'm thinking of one. I'm thinking of, um, okay, okay, driving or I'm, I'm, uh, something with okay, okay, something to get you guys in the mood, something to cheer you guys up. And maybe it might just be going around the city, doing this and that. I might do a behind the scenes, what I do when I'm not making a, well, when I am making a video, I might go behind the scenes of what I might be doing like throughout the summer or something like that. One day in the summer, I could just be making a DK vlog special. I mean, I the, the, the recommendations are high. I just want you guys to pick in all of the adjoining social medias. I'm probably not gonna put this on social media itself. I'm probably gonna put a, a separate announcement similar to this. And you guys, please just, I, I want you guys to know that I'm always gonna be here and I'll always be okay, okay, and super duper. But yeah, I mean, uh, YouTube itself has just grown and it's 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 gotten bigger in the past 10 years than any other. It's been the 10 year anniversary of when YouTube started giving out ads to just average day people. And the fact that you can just live off of YouTube or live off of mostly YouTube and not even do any other job considering to your major, it's just amazing. And I hope that I could even have the possibility to rely on most of my 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 income on YouTube and it would just be nice because I would have more free time to make you guys videos and I would make I'd still be keeping the schedule I, st I have a schedule if you guys don't know I I post live streams on Sunday Sundays at about 8 and I'm gonna probably change that in the description um, I have my normal videos every single Tuesday and Thursday at 3 p.m. exactly I schedule my videos I make them on the weekends I mean I'm making this on a Sunday and you won't see it until Tuesday that's how scheduled I am I want you guys to know that I put my dedication into this and maybe other YouTubers don't, but I do. And I just, I want you guys to know that I'm here and I'm not going anywhere for quite a bit of time. So just thank you guys for watching this. I know this turned from a YouTube general, like, you know, consensus of what happened to just a, just an understanding of what you guys mean to me. And I know I don't make any money. I was supposed to, by the way, before YouTube changed their policy. But I, I'm not in, I'm not doing this for the money. I'm doing this for the entertainment. I'm doing this for the comedy. I'm I if you go to my normal if you if you went to the waybackmachine.com, I think you could still find it. But go to the waybackmachine.com and usually that's reserved for like people that have um when you go back to the Wayback Machine, it is a project funded internet archive machine sort of that kind of captures the snapshot of the internet taken at that time and people can everyday people and companies can just snapshot every day um just put the link in every day that they can and it just it, it shows up there as a timeline and it'll be there for many years to come apple specifically i they have every day since 1996 uh, maybe not every day but they have a lot and uh, so does YouTube. I go back there every once in a while to check out what happened, what was trending. And I posted my channel there for a archive when I first started off, when I had 11 subscribers. You guys can still see every video that I had on my homepage, playlists, all the videos that I had, my my about section, my uh, my average views, my subscribers, just even my thumbnail, my, my channel-wide channel art. You guys can see, if you go there, it says, a day without laughter is a day wasted. That's the one that I used to use before I moved on and I had two more um, channel art banners and I had one uh, called DK Originals Home of Comedy. Sorry, Home of Entertainment. And now I have the one that I do now, DK Originals, YT, Comedy, Vlogs, and more. And okay, okay, too, now certified. So I'm probably gonna change that in the future, but it just, I, I want you guys to know that I do this to make you guys happy and to, to to just show you that there's always a reason for something. But with that, I'm done being serious, okay? I will post a DK Reacts video very soon, probably not today, it's kind of late. If I if I do get comments, I'll post it sooner, but you'll see my next episode on Thursday, of course. You can always check on the I cards, they, came, they, they come throughout the video, and uh, my end cards are just at the end. I never told you guys that, but if you guys stay, 
stay, you guys will see the end cards. But thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate your support. I will see you guys later. Bye bye. Okay. It matters. It matters to me.